We've all watched HGTV. We've all walked through model homes. We've all seen how staging changes the emotion of a property. So when it comes to selling your home, is it a worthwhile investment? Hey everyone, I'm Janelle Garrison, and today we're gonna to talk about one of the biggest questions you as a seller face when putting your home on the market. To stage or not to stage? Thankfully, I have Natalie Gray with Gray Group Designs here, and we're gonna have a conversation, ask some questions about it. So Natalie, based on your experience, what are the top three ways staging benefits a seller? Mm -hmm. Well, first off, staging benefits the seller by making sure that it shows well in the online photographs. That's what really drives the traffic to the property. So we know as professional stagers how to showcase a property so it shows well in person and in photographs. Secondly, professional staging highlights the selling features of the home. Strategically placing furniture, art, lighting, and accessories lets the buyer see the great flooring or the beautiful tile or the amazing archways. Our job is to enhance the features of the listing with the proper style, scale, and color. A third benefit of home staging is creating the emotional appeal, and we do that by pushing the right buyer buttons. Staging to appeal to the target market helps close the sale. Most buyers aren't buying a house, they're buying their next home that they wanna fall in love with. That's absolutely true. Obviously, there's a cost associated with staging. So a homeowner that's looking to maximize their investment, does staging make sense? Yes, absolutely. Staging and painting are probably the best returns on your investment for a couple of reasons. Buyers want move-in ready, and anything that they view as something they need to change, repair, or fix may cause them to either make a lower offer or maybe not make an offer at all. So we want to make sure that when we stage a home, it's move-in ready and we take all of those objections away. Secondly, staging a home is usually far less of an investment than a typical price reduction. So making sure that the seller is staging upfront gives them the best opportunity to get the highest possible price and sell as quickly as possible. It's true that you get one chance at a good impression. That's absolutely the case. So in knowing all of that, would there ever be a time where you would not recommend to stage a home? Sure, if the listing hits most of the marks that we've been talking about, but most homes need at least a little adjusting to make sure that they're photo ready. However, we don't always need to stage every single room. For example, secondary bedrooms might be left empty to accommodate budgets, and your agent and your stager can make recommendations and give you options. So obviously some homeowners have worked with a professional designer. Their homes are decorated throughout. Mm -hmm. Is there a difference between a home being decorated versus being staged? Yes, there really is a difference. Um, many people don't realize that home staging is very different from decorating. Decorating a home is about layering and adding more stuff to make it livable for you. Whereas home staging is really about marketing your property. So decorating tends to add more and staging is about minimizing and really opening up the space. So with staging, less is best. So Natalie, when considering hiring a stager or a staging company, what are some questions that a seller should ask? Mm -hmm. Well, first of all, ask your agent about their stager. There's usually a pretty good reason they have certain people on their team. They'll give you a lot of really good insight just with that. Secondly, make sure that you take a look at the website, look at their work, ask questions, and make sure that they're a professional stager. Are they trained? Are they certified? Are they insured? And finally, you wanna make sure that, like most things, you get what you pay for. So make sure that your expectations on service and quality are all the things that the staging company can actually deliver. Natalie, thank you so much for giving us all of this information. And to anyone that was watching this, if there was some questions that we didn't go over and that you would like answered or some additional information we can provide you with, Natalie and my contact information is on the screen. Please feel free to reach out. Have a great day, guys, and thanks so much for watching. Thank you. Thank you.